This is a pack of animated text presets. It works with Animation Composer, our awesome free plugin for Adobe After Effects. And it might be the most creative tool you'll ever have. This text is an example. You can create simple things or complex. Text is the essential building block. It can be very powerful if you get it right. And with this tool, it's quick, easy, and fun. Let's take a look at how it works. First, I select a layer. Then I start looking for a preset. There are many different categories and also different animation styles inside of them. For example, the basic easing, bounce, flicker, overshoot, or wiggly. So let's select this preset and apply it to the beginning of the layer. Let's preview it. Looks great. So now let's add another preset. This one looks good. I'll apply it as out transition. Let's take a look. Great. I can easily remove it and apply another. This one animated from the right. And this is how it looks. Let's take a look at editing. I can change the duration of the transition just by dragging this marker. And here I can make adjustments. For example, reverse order of the characters or randomize it. Each preset has different settings. I can play with the positioning and rotation. I can reset it to the default. And a quick tip, right click to reveal the preset in the Browse tab. Now let's look at effect presets. These animate the layer over time. There's stuff like decoding and many other creative effects like a wiggle. Or stuff that looks like jumping. I'll select this folder and let's add something. I select the layer and apply this preset. You can see it animates for the whole duration of the layer. This is how it looks when you play it. Let's adjust the animation. I'll decrease the number of wiggles per second. You can see how it slows down in real time. Then I adjust the position and the rotation. And this is how it looks. Now I'll reset to default and show you one more thing. Every effect has this intensity slider where you can adjust the overall intensity of the effect. You can also set where the effect should start or end. I added the start marker. Now the layer doesn't move before it and moves after it. You can adjust the transition by changing the marker duration. Now let's add the end marker. And this is how it looks. And of course, it's a text layer, so you can use any font. And what I love the most, when I'm working on a video, I never know what exactly I need. This way, I can very quickly try different things and see what looks best. Moreover, I get a ton of inspiration on the way. People who purchased it love it. This tool could not be more awesome. Get it and you won't regret it, guaranteed.